Unit 4. Vocabulary and Listening. Exercise 1. 1. Do you ever listen to English when you're out of school? E. 2. Do you know the alphabet? Can you spell your name in English? H. 3. Do you check words in a dictionary or word list? D. 4. Do you repeat a new word if you want to learn it? C. 5. Do you ever practice your pronunciation? A. 6. Do you revise before an exam? I. 7. Do you ask questions when you don't understand? J. 8. Do you usually concentrate when you do your homework? B. 9. Do you make notes about grammar or write new vocabulary in your notebook? F. 10. Do you ever read books, articles or comics in English? G. Unit 4. Vocabulary and Listening. Exercise 1. 1. Do you ever listen to English when you're out of school? E. 2. Do you know the alphabet? Can you spell your name in English? H. 3. Do you check words in a dictionary or word list? D. 4. Do you repeat a new word if you want to learn it? C. 5. Do you ever practice your pronunciation? A. 6. Do you revise before an exam? I. 7. Do you ask questions when you don't understand? J. 8. Do you usually concentrate when you do your homework? B. 9. Do you make notes about grammar or write new vocabulary in your notebook? F. 10. Do you ever read books, articles or comics in English? G. Unit 4. Vocabulary and Listening. Exercises 3 and 4. 1. So, Mario, you're a football player. Are you learning English? Yes, I am, because I live here and I play football here, ball here. What are you doing now? I'm watching TV. <laughs> it's good for my English. Is English difficult? It's OK. My listening is not so good. 2. Mark, Peter, police officers in London are learning languages. That's right. Are you learning the same language? No, we aren't. I'm learning Russian and Peter's learning Arabic. Why are you studying those languages? Because a lot of people from different countries live in London or visit London. What are you doing now, Mark? I'm checking new vocabulary on the internet. Is Russian difficult? <laughs> For me, yes. It's got different letters. Reading, reading and writing are difficult. 3. Hannah, what language are you studying? Mandarin. Really? At school? Yes. We've got a teacher from China. What are you doing now? I'm revising for my exams now. 
Is Mandarin a difficult language? Yes, it's very difficult. The pronunciation, the sounds are difficult, but I like it. Can you say goodbye in Mandarin? Yes, 再见 Unit Four: Vocabulary and Listening. Exercises three and four. One. So Mario, you're a football player. Are you learning English? Yes, I am because I live here and I play football here. Ball here. What are you doing now? I'm watching TV. <laughs> It's good for my English. Is English difficult? It's okay. My listening is not so good. Two. Mark, Peter, police officers in London are learning languages. That's right. Are you learning the same language? No, we aren't. I'm learning Russian, and Peter's learning Arabic. Why are you studying those languages? Because a lot of people from different countries live in London or visit London. What are you doing now, Mark? I'm checking new vocabulary on the internet. Is Russian difficult? <laughs> For me, yes. It's got different letters. Reading, reading, and writing are difficult. Three. Hannah. What language are you studying? Mandarin. Really? At school? Yes. We've got a teacher from China. What are you doing now? I'm revising for my exams now. Is Mandarin a difficult language? Yes, it's very difficult. The pronunciation, the sounds are difficult, but I like it. Can you say goodbye in Mandarin? Yes. 再见。